Texting Keegan. You know, or that was his idea? Yeah. And now Louise has loads of idiots messaging her because of it. Is all right? Yeah, she will be. You know, I was, um, kind of hoping I'd bump into you. I know you have. I guess so. Hey, look, I've got to go. I've got history. Yeah, yeah, me too. Maybe we could, um, we could talk after. All right, I'll wait for you. <laughs> Right? Uh, why won't she be? She tried bunking off this morning. Oh, I, I thought she would have mentioned it to you. Seeing as you're such good friends all of a sudden. Um, we're the ones that bothered to take care of her after what your boyfriend did to her. That was Keegan, not Shaki. Anyway, it's not my boyfriend. The important thing is not let him get away with it. If she wants people to stop bugging her, she needs to get her own back. You really think? No. Yes. What was she know? She was just some sad goth until five minutes ago. Right, um... I'll walk you home, yeah? Unless... you want to go to drum club. What do you think? Who are you looking around for? for? Seems like you're waiting for someone. Oh, no, no one important. I'm done. See ya. Three hot chocolates, please. I'll check your text if I were you. Everyone at school knows about you getting down and dirty with the American. I might have mentioned it to a few people. Bex is open for business. That's what they're saying. But don't worry. We'll back you. It's not your fault you can't keep your knickers on, is it? Low self-esteem. Leave it, yeah? <laughs> Did you assault Rebecca Fowler yesterday afternoon in the G-Block toilets? Alexandra? No. She alleges you did. Why would she say that if it's not true? Ask her. She also says that you and at least one other girl have been subjecting her to systematic verbal and physical attacks for some weeks now. She says. What does that mean? So that's it, is it? All this is just on her say so. <laughs> no proof. There's CCTV outside in toilets, isn't there? There is but the camera was deliberately turned away from the door. Suppose you don't know anything about that, either. I don't know what she's talking about. I've had them. Do you like Bex Fowler, Madison? Never really thought about her. That's surprising. She's all most students in this school have been thinking about and talking about for the last month, at least. Then she shouldn't have had that disgusting photo on her phone, then, should she? Maybe girls who do that sort of thing deserve to be taught a lesson. <laughs> Maybe. Did you teach her a lesson, Madison? Yesterday afternoon in G-Block toilets. Is that what Bex has been saying? We're more interested in what you've got to say. Madison. I don't know what she's talking about. I don't believe you. You've seen what they've been doing to me and you've said nothing. We are through. And whatever you've got in mind, forget about it. Because Mrs London knows all about you now. Yeah, she does. And what's she done? Nothing. Bring it on. Thanks. Customer. What do you want? Quick words. I've got nothing to say to you. Please. Yeah, I know you're angry and you've got good reason to be. But I came here to warn you. It's about tonight. Do you think I'm really going to go to the cinema with you after what you did? You're angry. 
I get it. I'm sorry, I shouldn't have come. Wait, wait. What about tonight? Alex, put some seats behind you. She's gonna wait for the film to start and cut your hair. Well, why are you telling me? Because they're taking it too far. No, I said that to them last night. Alex freaks on now I'm out. But I don't care. Like, I know what we've done to you was wrong, but I guess I was just scared of her. But I'm not scared anymore. Look, Bex, I just want you to know that. I'm sorry, OK? Still on for tonight? Don't tell me you've forgotten. Cinema? Uh, I, I can't. I'm, I'm sorry. I've got a really bad headache. I was going to text you. Spoken to Madison today? No. No way. She wanted to do stuff to you, like embarrass you. We said we were done with those games now. But she wouldn't let it go. Would she, Lou? No. I mean, you know we're just messing around, right? But Madison, she really seems to hate you. But don't worry, we'll sort her out for you. Look, you don't need to do that. We um... insist. Don't we, Lou? What are you going to do to her? Nothing too bad. Hope your headache gets better. Louise! Thanks for coming. Do you want to sit down? I can't stop thinking about what we've done to you, Bex. And I just wanted to say that I'm really, really sorry. Sunday. It's gonna take a while for me to be able to trust you again, Louise. Oi, I want a word with you. You know I got grounded, don't you? Oh, cos she went crying to mummy. I'm sorry. So, you two friends again, yeah? No, 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 we were just talking, that's all. You are unbelievable. 